Hi guys, today I'm gonna show you how I made these fondant teddy bears. We're gonna start by using a craft ball and we're gonna start shaving off the sides, leaving the bottom part a little bit thicker. I know this fondant looks really dry, but it has CMC powder because we want it to hold its shape and dry faster. Now for the clothes, we're gonna be using some blue fondant and I'm adding a toothpick for added support. These are gonna be the small suspenders that are gonna go on the teddy bear. Now I'm gluing everything together with some water you're gonna need some fondant tools because they will come in handy. Now I'm adding the buttons and some more added detail. I already uploaded the detail tutorial on YouTube if you guys wanna check that out. Now for the leg, I use one piece of fondant and I kinda shape both legs at the same time and then just cut it in half. Once you shape the leg, we're gonna glue it on the teddy bear using a little bit of water, but first you're gonna indent with the fondant tool uh, just to make a little bit more space and the legs are not too out. For the arms, I'm gonna be doing the same thing. Just roll some fondant, cut it in half, and then shape them. Then we're gonna glue it on the teddy bear the same way that we did the legs. I honestly eyeball everything, so I don't really weigh how much the legs are or the arms. I kinda just go by what I see. Then for the texture on the teddy bear, I'm using a toothpick. You do have to kinda clean it out um, in the middle of doing this because then the toothpick gets full of fondant. Then I'm adding the head to the body. This is just fondant, no uh, foam ball inside. I added the nose, then the ears are two balls of fondant with a little bit of lighter fondant on top. I'm sticking that on with some water, and then we're adding texture to the face. I forgot that the suspenders needed more details, so I took off the head, I added the details, and stuck the head back on with water. I then added a light piece of fondant to the paws and then now it's time to make the eyes which I'm just using a ball tool and some black fondant. I then added the nose and a small line in the middle and now it's time to make the bow. For the bow you just get a piece of fondant and then start folding the ends multiple times and then fold that in half. We're going to do two of those then cut off the excess uh, fondant at the end and we're going to glue that with some water. This was for a baby shower cake, and all the details made this cake so beautiful. I got my inspiration from Pinterest. I don't know if this happens to you guys, but when I get an order, I get obsessed. I start, like, I can't even sleep just looking for inspiration and just ideas. I just love it. But this is how the cake turned out. It was so beautiful, and I was wondering how much would you guys charge for this cake?